gentlemen so welcome back this is part three of little big world we are uh as you can see we got a little a little stump something something going right now we got some teddy bears that we're making we got some uh, square tables that we're making not very expensive but they're a little something something that'll keep us having some money while uh i think the next thing we're gonna work on is we got some of these challenges to do um 2000 2000 he's giving me low money i don't really care about his uh right here we got 15 units for 8000 we'll probably uh end up doing that but before we end up doing that i want to set up we also have 9000 for seven units of this bike now these these two uh as you can see it's it it goes a lot it, it well maybe not this one this one's kind of easy this one's not too bad, but if you if you look at the other one, like this one, oh yeah, there's a lot going on here, a lot going on here. So before we get into stuff like this, I want to have, I want to make my, we're still small. We're doing big orders, as you can see, we're filling up the stock room, we're doing big orders, but we're still small. Um, so what I want to do is I want to buy another whole square and i want to start making these into full warehouses so i want to make one big square of a whole bunch of machines uh maybe make this room full of all the workshops and then have this room full of uh sewing so all the sewing could get done fast because it seems like the sewing stuff is what's kind of slow and uh, there's no machines for sewing. It's kind of, you know, workshop sewing. So we'll do all the workshops of sewing in here. Put all the different uh, miscellaneous workshops here. And this is going to be built of nothing but machines. Now, it's going to be a lot. It's going to be a lot of money. Um, so I think the first thing we should do is go ahead and build the land. Or buy the land, I should say. Let's see. How do I do that? Uh, I think it's this. Yeah. Let's go ahead and buy this land. For six, okay, for 6,000 is cheaper than it was. Because I have that, uh, I have that, uh, there you go. Boom. So now we can uh, open this up. It's going to be a whole bunch of machines and stuff. Um, let's open we're going to open this up some more all the way as much as possible uh, I think I pressed the wrong thing we're going to open this up as much as possible let's Come on. There we go. And we're going to do that. We're going to blow that up and blow that negative. I went the wrong way. Did the wrong thing. Hold on completely messed that up yes exactly what I wanted to do right there I wanted to just blow this up that's what I wanted to do all right so we're gonna open this up more <coughs> I'm going to have to start moving some things around. Um, I definitely want to open up. I definitely want to open up all this to be stock room. Uh, hopefully that's my mom. Uh, but yeah, let's see what else we can do here. I don't want to spend too much money because... I want to stay at least in the in the 10,000s.
Someone's uh, ringing the doorbell. Let's see. Fresh, that's nice. your company is larger than the, my pet project sanguan logistics well well maybe it's time i put stop to your little workshop for silly products you better leave me alone bro you better leave me alone all right this is uh where it's looking like so far the storage room this is gonna be all though for the materials and i'm gonna put this and this is gonna be all for uh finished products uh, so we'll see We'll see how this ends up looking. Build some more room here. We're gonna make this though, basically the sewing stuff, and then we'll try to move some more, uh, some more machines over here, and then we'll start really producing big time. All right, so I decided that I'm going to end up making this a part of the storage as well. So this is gonna be all, this is gonna end up being all of the, uh, what do you call it? Uh, stock, you know, all the stuff, all the resources. And then this whole thing is going to be a uh, finished product. So I'm gonna connect these two rooms and make this whole thing finished product. This is all gonna be stock. We're gonna make this the bench area. I'm turning this area into nothing but sewing machines. Uh, we're down to 5,000, a little bit less than I want it to be. Break room's the same. We still got seven, seven points. Uh, plenty of things in there uh, to restore the points fast enough, so we're good there. Um, so yeah, we'll probably make another big old area right here and turn that into a machine room and then we'll have another room right here and uh, yeah I don't exactly know what those rooms are gonna have in there yet I just know that I want to take all these machines that I have here and put that all in a room and fill this area up with more uh, assembly lines and workbenches and uh, we'll go from there. We'll see. We'll see. We're going to probably have four of these. Four of these. Probably four of each machine. Maybe two of some, but four of each. We'll see how it goes. But as of right now, I got 5,000. Like I said, I'm a little lower than I want it to be. But um, we're going to finish these up. Then we're going to see what other, anything else I can produce to get us some money to stack up again and then uh we'll try to remodel some more so that's that's what we're looking at all right so i've cleared out this space cleared out this space everything's brand new they're putting in some new resources for the table we're doing a table for homeboy right here we're gonna get uh oh here it is right here we're gonna get 10 g's for 14 units we're on a contract so that's gonna be a nice 10 G's right there. Everything's ready to go. Everybody, every every piece has its own spot already. So now what I'm basically gonna do is we're just going to do a few jobs here and there, build back up, cause we're down to like 7,000. Build back up to get it back to like the 20s. That way we can build another area right here and we can start relocating this stuff, all the machinery to here and then after that I'll probably be down again break this wall make this whole thing completely for finished product um, I'll probably be down again do a few projects to get money up and then I will stock up this room because this room will be all these machineries in this room and this room will be in this room so I'll be able to stock up with some more uh, workbenches. I'll be able to have some more uh, assembly lines and workbenches. And that's 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 the uh, that's what we're looking at right now.
Looks like people are getting their jobs done. Doesn't look like, uh, you know. So far, so good. Looks like everyone's just doing their thing. We already got one table down right there. So these these jobs, this job should go pretty smooth. Oh, I just went down. Okay, no, I was gonna say. I was gonna say, no way. All right. So that's what we're doing. We're basically now. We did a little remodeling. Things are a little bit more, a little bit more. Um, still a mess here, but this is definitely going to be a lot more uh, clean. Like this one is a lot, a lot more organized. We'll organize this area after we make a couple of money and build another room here. So we can empty this out, can have this completely organized, and then hopefully empty the machinery in here. Have this completely organized with assembly benches and workbenches, and have our all our machines in here. So we'll see what happens. See how it goes. All right. So I uh, one second. Sorry. So I have keep losing here. I don't make it on time for this contract that I'm trying to do. I've tried different things. I keep running out of money. Um, then when the contract's over, I still have, don't have no money to really do anything. So what I did was, I think I'll be good now because it looks like it's in the green like I will make the contract if I don't run out of money before I did but I had to sell two of my sewing machine uh, sewing tables so I sold two of those I bought me an extra one of these because this is the only thing that that is slowing me down everybody else finishes their jobs except for the one that's doing this so I split that job in half also as you can see the market refreshes it keeps refreshing and this is going to be at 800 for a good minute. So after this is over and I make and I make the um, and I make this contract, I'll get ten thousand dollars. And I'm just going to build a whole bunch of tables because these tables are going to be hot for for um, a couple of days. So I'll build as many tables and try to stack up my money that way because. Right now, I don't see any other way for me to make money right now after getting stuck in this contract. Now, the thing is, usually I haven't had a problem before because usually what happens is, like, I have nine tables, I have ten tables ready to go. I usually sell them when I'm in the red like this and get them out the way. But I found out just recently now that once you're in a, when you're in a contract, you can't sell any of those tables until you've gotten the amount of contracts needed. And um, yeah, so uh, as you can see, I'm at 3,000. I'm going to be at 4,000. Once I go to 4,000, if I'm not close enough, then I'm going to have to sell another sewing table just to make sure uh, I don't go bankrupt. Um, so let's see. I'm still doing good. It's pretty much a race against time right now. I don't know if I'll make this, but if I got it, I'll sell this, this sewing stuff sewing table again looks like I'm about to be 4,000 right now and I'm gonna go ahead Ooh, it's close it's close I might have to go sell it just in case oh it's cutting it close yeah I'm just just go ahead and sell it I'll buy it once I buy the sewing table once I get back in to the Still cutting it close. Jeez Louise. Oh, come on. Get it over there. Get it over there. Get that table out of here. Get that table out of here. Give me that money. Thank you. Okay. Now I should make. I'm back to 3,000. I'll be fine now. I should get 10,000, which will put me, probably put me at like 8,000. 
after I get out of my debt. I barely made it. What is... Alright, made my delivery. Truck en route. So they're picking up everything. Now I'm just gonna go ahead use our 800 a piece. I'm gonna go ahead. This is, no, that's not what I want. I want this to go here. I want this to go here. I want this to go here. And you to go. There you go. No, 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 no. Well, we could do that. And you to go. We'll split it. I don't even got my money yet. table yet. Alright, there we go. Uh, now I got my money. Let's make sure you're going there. You're going... Where are you going? No. Seventeen is a cute, uh, and we will do um, This is going to be 16. We're going to split that. We're going to split this to 888. And we're going to split this. One, four. We'll put one here. And we'll put. I mean, if it's possible, we'll see. See how fast this goes. What is this? Sabotage. Let's see how everybody else is working, did I not? Hey, go fix that. Right here. Let's see how fast I can make some tables. Sixty-four, yeah, I see I need a lot of these. How much of one of these, bro? Three thousand. This is not going to be. You know what? What if I? What I have been able 
to Let's see. Bro, I don't know if this is going to work either, so we'll see when we get back. Um, I'm, so, I'm so deep in right now. I got another welding. I'm trying to, I'm trying to make a profit building these skis um it's hard man everything that i can make a profit on it needs me to do have double of something that i'm missing so i just took care of some parasite that was in the work office gave me a couple thousand for that and that was it allowed me to to sell some skis that i had already was building and um come up a little bit enough to buy an, an extra welder so now I got two welding stations and I'm hoping that this is going to make things run a lot faster as far as these skates because as you can see these skates look like they're gonna still be up in the 500s for a good minute uh, so it should be good so hopefully I can get um I can get out of debt here because I've been in, in trouble for a minute. I haven't been able to get past this level, but right now I'm feeling calm. I'm seeing that I'm I'm getting some skates faster. some more workers work Actually, I don't want to 
this is uh, this is pretty much you gotta be a skating. Oh wow! I mean, we're gonna have to leave it here, and uh, I gotta go to bed. We're gonna have to leave it here, and I'm gonna have to hopefully come back and understand, remember what it is that I'm doing here, and uh, that's it. It's man RTP. We out for the day. Deuce.